again, Kate Round, tour guide and outreach worker based at the Red House Glass Cone. Let's have another bit of glass. Last time I spoke to you about a dreadful accident that occurred at a glassworks. That was recorded in the newspaper. Many accidents weren't recorded. There was a dreadful accident that happened in 1835 where a young lad was killed, but it went unrecorded until 2001. In April 2001, a specialist company was excavating the cemetery of the Congregational Chapel in Stourbridge and they unearthed a glass memorial tablet. The tablet measured 20 centimetres by 10 centimetres and 1 centimetre thick. It records the death on the 14th of July in 1835 of Thomas Hammond. He was killed by a potsherd of clay, a lump of clay being thrown not at him but another lad, uh, James Wood. James Wood was a cutter's apprentice. Thomas was an apprentice in the warehouse at the White House, Glasgow in Wordsley. He was killed instantly. He was 16 years old. He was the only son of John and Sarah Hammond. This tablet had been made and engraved uh, by a local glassmaker, a John Shepherd, who worked at the same company. The tablet was buried with the lad. There's many stories of hauntings, ghosts, spirits, whatever you call them, in these old buildings of Stourbridge, and many sightings. And many people that worked at Stewart's claim to have seen um, the spirit or the ghost of a young lad near the gate. The young lad, his presence was unexplained, but he was seen by many people. However, after the memorial tablet had been unearthed in 2001, the spirit of the young lad was never seen again. See you next time.